A lot of times, you know, a controversy that we often have that I've kind of brought up is fake it till you make it. And it, like when you think about it, it's kind of weird because we all hear the saying fake it till you make it in success and everything you do. But can you actually fake compassion? So now I'm gonna get a lot of pushback on this, I tell you that right now. Because let me tell you, you can fake it till you make it. Now I know you guys are gonna hate that I said that, but here's the reason I'm saying that is because I've brought people out into the compassion movement that weren't that compassionate, that I said, just come out and do it with us a little bit and, and see how you feel and get involved. And a couple of my, I won't mention names, but a couple of my guy friends were like, all right, I'm just gonna do this for you. And you could tell they were truly faking it. They didn't have it so much in, in them. Now, as the one guy came out three or four times with us now, about you know a month ago, me and him sat down and he goes to me, you know, I'm feeling a lot more in my heart now that I gotta do more. So let's, to be honest, at the start, he was kind of faking it when he was with us. I knew truly deep down he wasn't that compassionate, but as he got more involved, I noticed he evolved to be more compassionate. So can you kind of fake it till you make it with compassion? Heck yeah, you can. But it just sounds bad when you say fake it till you make it with compassion. And I know that there's gonna be a lot of pushback on that and everything, but the bottom line is if somebody's coming out and the more that they do it, you can help change their nervous system and help them become more of a compassionate person. So I believe you can fake it till you make it with compassion.